Cappies! Hello, my darlings. Capricorns. Wow, Cappies. Oh my God. All right, ladies and gentlemen, this is a business reading for the Capricorn Sun, Moon, and Rising Sun for the month of June. Whenever you pick up this reading, it's the time you should receive it. It is a timeless reading. So, this is the business reading. Okay. Ladies and gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen, I must say this, um, um, these readings are extended so you can pick them up on my website, okay? So, please like and share these videos. Capricorn, Capricorn, Capricorn. You are definitely going to be receiving a new start in business and it is going to be a very successful start. If you are starting a new job, it's going to be good. Um, in the first week of June, go for it. You're going to be a success. Uh, the second week, we have the Ten of Wands. You have some burdens in the second week. Um, and whatever the burdens is in the third week, you're going to be victoriously overcoming these burdens. Um, whoever that was created these burdens, you are going to be overcoming these burdens. These burdens was created by a Leo. Whoever this Leo is, I see they're going to be picking up this Leo and uh, blocking this Leo from moving forward, okay? So if you notice, this Leo is not moving forward. They are blocked, okay? So, fourth week, I see it's as if you, Capricorns, is going to be taking on this uh, um, investigation sort of a thing. So if you notice, um, Capricorns, um, if there was stunt and growth and that sort of a thing, I see you are going to be overcoming this. Whatever the burdens that you were having was created by this Leo person. And I see in the last week, they're finally taking down this Leo person because it's as if they have been investigating this Leo person. And uh, I definitely see that in the last week, they're finally going to take down this Leo person. And I see you're standing your ground against this Leo person that this Leo person doesn't get a new start. So whoever this Leo person is, this Leo person has done some deceptiveness, okay? Because this Leo person is not going to, you're going to make sure that this person do not have a new start. A Leo and a Sagittarius has created some deceptiveness and they are not going to have a new start because of what they have done. So what we see here is that this month in business and in work is going to be good for you guys. The Ten of Cups. Now, the Ten of Cups is where you feel the happiest at what you're doing. So if you started a new job, it's going to be good. If you are creating something new, it's going to be good. This month of June is going to be a fabulous month. If you notice how many uh, yes, energy is here is that we have the star, we have the ten of cups, we have the world, and we have the victory and success in the third week. So here you are, Capricorns, and trust me, um, you know, watch out for the people who is going to be raining and parading because guess what? No matter what they do, bam, 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 Cappy, no matter. Who is going to be coming in to rain and parade? Look at what you have. You have the Ten of Cups and you have the Sun. This is about huge success that is coming up for you, Capricorns. I see that some of you Capricorns that has made it, um, that has uh, made it a fault. Some of you Capricorns is going to be finding out some information, um, about. Uh, either a company or a group of people that has done some deceptiveness and you're going to bring it out and you're going to be showing them up for the deceptiveness that they have done. So Capricorns, this is going to be good. Follow the energy of this extended reading to see where it's going to be coming out. But it's as if you Capricorns is bringing out secrets, secrets about company um, and uh, secrets about what was done and no one has um, opened up and spoken about it. And I see you are bringing back balance in corporation institutes. And this is going to be good. So let's move in. So what we're seeing in the first week for you Capricorns is that definitely you are, um, you are creating your world, 
you're creating your own, uh, your own financial um, stability and you are getting a new start in the first week of June. Whatever has happened and transpiring, you are definitely getting a new start in the month of June and you are creating um, this new start. Whatever issues and situation is, these two together is huge success. The star and the world together is huge success. If you decide to start a company, start a business, or to um, start in a new corporation, you are going to be successful at whatever you decide to start in the first week of June in business and in work. Some of you, if you're doing exam in the first week, you're going to be passing. It's a yes. It is also a month. If you do any exams, um, in this month is going to be a yes. Capricorns, remember, sign in contract. Uh, wait until the 12th of July to sign any contracts. If you have to and you must, but um, uh, uh, Mercury is in retrograde. And a lot of people are not aware of this, that when Mer only when you were born in a Mercury retrograde, is it good to do anything? Um, you're one of these lucky people um, that goes through retrograde, especially Mercury retrograde is don't sign contracts. If you don't have to do it, uh, don't do it. But uh, if not, let it go. But it's going to be good. Second week, what we're seeing, whatever burdens that you were carrying, burdens, financial burdens in the sense of you have to pay for your exam, pay for your uh, student or whatever. I see that this is going to be over. In the third week, you are going to be finding out that your burdens was created by a Sagittarius and a Leo. Okay? A Sagittarius and a Leo has blocked you guys for a very long time. And I see that uh, they it, it's going to be coming up and you're going to be finding out that these two people were the people that has blocked um your success for a very long time and i see you coming in this month of june that you're removing these people out of your life okay um whatever your burden so was or is i see your burdens are going to be over and i see that you're going to be whatever has transpired you're going to be making sure that the sagittarius and this leo never have another chance to do this to anyone you're going to be making sure that whoever this Sagittarius and this Leo is never will have another chance to do this to anyone because it is very deceptive um what these two people have done and I see you could either be the manager or um you have found out what they have done and I see that a Sagittarius and a Leo has tried to create some very distorting, deceptive things. And I see no new start is going to be coming in for them. And I see that um, people in power is also going to be um, 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 backing you in order um, to um, definitely give you a new start. Okay. So whoever this Leo is, you're going to be victorious and successful over this Leo. And I see you need to let go of the past and look at the future. A lot of you are thinking about what had happened to you in the past. The past is the past. Create your new future. Um, you know, the people who you are going to be thinking and worried about what they have done to you in the past. Ladies and gentlemen, trust me, everyone that has stabbed you in your back at your work, they have gotten it and they will receive it. Okay. So, um, just stand up and understand who you are and realize that you're going to be victoriously overcoming and having a new start moving forward in a very positive direction. Um, I see some of you are dealing um with the energy um the fool is an aquarian man whoever this aquarian man is this aquarian man is uh, trying to put a, a stop or is trying to block to you whoever this aquarian man is he needs to find something else to do because i see at the end of the the this four week period whoever this aquarian man is is as if they want to stop you and they want to block you and I see that you're going to be protecting yourself. It's as if they don't want, but it, it's not for you, Capricorn, what they're saying. It is for this uh, Leo, because you're going to be victoriously overcoming the obstacles that a Leo has created. And I see that you're going to be 
receiving um, protection from people in power. So whatever is transpiring, you're definitely going to be um, receiving some protection from people in power. And if you notice uh, that this uh, Leo has no new start and they're blocking this Leo, um, people in power is blocking this Leo and this Leo won't have a new start because they realize the deceptiveness that this Leo has done. So um, Capricorns, if you feel as if, because if you notice Capricorns, you have the energy of the sun and the ten of cups. So it's a goal for you. The green light is yes, it's a goal. Okay. So, and you see, you brought out the secrets about what was going on in a corporation institution. You brought out the secrets. You gave the information um, because if you notice these information are all, and these people, these are all people that has been working on a, a huge growth scheme and plot. They, if you notice, all these 10 people have plotted together with each other against you and you're deep plotting um, whatever they have done. Here you have, you're showing and deep plotting and showing the connection of what they have done. And I see that some of you um, people in public, people are going to be, a lot of recognition is going to be coming in for some of you um, Capricorns, because some of you Capricorns had choose the wrong side of the fence. And now I see you are trying to um, declutter lies and showing up these people, because it's as if some of you got in a situation where um, there was some deceptiveness and someone took you on as a client. Some someone took you on, you took on a client and you choose for the wrong side of the fence. And I see you Capricorns now are realizing that, um, wow, I think I, wow. And because you were caught, you, you were caught and I see you're trying to resolve an issue and a situation. I see you're definitely trying to resolve an issue and a situation. And what is happening and transpiring is that um, you're trying to redo or undo um, because you choose for the wrong side of the fence. And, you know, Capricorns, this is good. Um, I see that a lot of you want to heal, um, what is, um, heal a situation. And guess what you have? Yes, you are going to be receiving the energy to redo or undo the fault that you have done, okay? So this is wonderful and this is good because what is happening here and what is transpiring is that you have the energy of the elk. And the energy of the elk, this is a real tough terrain, tall, um, Capricorn. And I see a lot of you Capricorn in business and in work is going to be taking on the energy of the elk, Okay, this is an earth sign. You have your own earth energy along with the world and the star together. So I see that a lot of you Capricorn that has made some wrong decision in the past is going to be rewriting the future and, and making um the changes and accepting that you were wrong and you're going to be correcting the wrong that you have made right. And nothing is so much powerful when people realize that they have made a huge fault and correct the fault in order to clear whatever has transpired. You have the energy of the elk, this energy of the elk. And if you notice the ace of one is in reverse and, um, this um, energy of the elk with the ace of one in reverse is saying that you Capricorns are going to be creating the and healing and um, making sure that you're making correction to the faults that you have made in the past. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. Um, Capricorns, I am going to go further. Okay, this, uh, this reading is uh, an extended reading. You uh, don't have to be a member of this channel. This channel, you can use the link in order to go to my website and pick up this reading. However, this is happening and transpiring. Go to my website, pick up this reading. Um, I love you guys. Please like and share this reading and uh, thumbs up and to all the Capricorns out there who have uh, done some um, or make wrong decision or didn't make the right decision in the past and didn't choose the right side. 
um, in this month, you're going to be making your correction and the universe is behind you, the star, the world that is going to be making you this correction, help you to make the correction. So you will receive a new start. Congratulations to all you guys. It looks good. I see you're going to be overcoming um, whatever the issues and the situation that you have and the obstacles are going to be falling in the second week and you're going to be protected moving forward and um, protected from a Sagittarius and a Leo who has done you some injustice. So ladies and gentlemen, let's um, move forward. Um, if I don't see on the other side, I'm wishing you a wonderful month because it's going to be fab, fab, fab. Um, I speak to you later, guys. Namaste.